boring looking one. Lemonade Brawl. Well, I already did this, so you have the honor of doing it. It's the last time you played a slug game. Mm. I don't know. <laughs> Bad answer. Listen up, dirtbag. Time to clear out. From now on, this bar is Cooper Gang turf. Tough, tough, wagga. But you ain't got no respect with us. We here are known around these parts for our drinking skills. And this just happens to be a lemonade Slime, I'm not sure this, this is This was the weirdest a introduction idea. to the series well, when I first played this. What you had in mind, then the three of us will take on the best three yeah. lemonade drinkers you Technically, got. this is my first life game. But then I thought Sly Cooper and Thebus Rakutis was this game, because I didn't know how to read, apparently. And I found the game in a, so some random spot at the, at the mall. Like, no, it wasn't even at the GameStop. No, it was just uh, it was just lying around somewhere. Some kid must have left it behind on the second floor of the of the entrance. So I think uh, J C Penny. Yeah, it was basically I bought a Sly Cooper at Thieves Raccoonus as a at a J C Penny. Really? Yeah, some like I said, somebody left it there. I don't even know how you do that, because GameStop has security to prevent you from doing that. But apparently somebody left it there, just lying around at JCPenney, and we had to buy it there. How did that work? I don't know, they just let us do it. Oh yeah, we'll see this game. We win. So don't ask me about the how it happened, I was really young when, when I bought the game. Well, it's time for you to relearn the controls. Well, if it was tough, anyway, I mean, I hope I'm... Well, you're not exactly playing Murray here, who, who moves forward with his punches. Yeah, watch out for those. I told you to watch out for those. Don't be right next to them when they get back up. That's like the one thing I need to. The Elliot needs to know when he plays these games. Well, he finished the series already. He played Sly Cooper Thieves in time. He's not gonna play another Sly game. You know, unless it's like. Oh, Elliot recently announced that he's gonna be doing the whole. Not the whole series. That'd be, that'd be something. He announced that he's gonna redo Sly 3. And considering how bad of a note Sly 3 ended on. Uh, they'd probably... I wouldn't say that'd be out of left field. I mean, they had Elliot redo his Crash 3 playthrough. I wouldn't be surprised that they, uh, if he ever did Sly 3 again. And you know, the best part is they never acknowledge the negative reception. Like, have you noticed how throughout these in time, whenever they, they never call back to the comment section of Sly 3 and how badly received their parts, their videos were? Remember that one time when I told you to make uh, that <laughs> that one comment where a really blunt comment no, saying no. Elliot you suck or yeah. something? <laughs> and I remember I was the one who told you to do that. I think the only reason I couldn't because um yeah mostly because I've been making too many comments that saying that straight up would probably be really bad for me. And the fact that I already made a comment then already saying the same thing that he sucks. And then I told you to make the really blunt, really blunt, you suck. And your chair just hit the air. 
Ow. You better not die as Murray. Okay, do not touch electricity. Electricity bad. No, you cannot pick up the bottle. Here anytime soon. Um, oh, I forgot about this. <laughs> Here's a strategy. If you actually do not immediately, um, you know when he gets stunned and you have to attack him? Yeah. If you don't deal the final blow, like, immediately, you actually give more time for the other gang members to set up their attacks. So, if you actually do not immediately take him out, it actually is qu quicker and safer. Oh, and I tried to not bother with the, with the furnace there. It doesn't work. Oh yeah, you can get harmed by the bombs in this version. So yeah, four hits, I guess. Don't hit him on the fourth hit and wait until he's about to recover. And then you can, uh, they'll already be ready. Hey, hurry. Oh, hit him. What are you oh. doing? Hit him. Let's not one time. Yeah, there. Yeah, you'll know he's about to do it when he's, when he's basically almost recovering. Yeah, just wait. Yeah, no. Somewhere around there you do it. You can go riskier, but there's a chance it might backfire. Oh yeah, don't forget you can get hurt by Murray's barrel. I hope you haven't forgotten about that. Get too close. Okay, just that should be the final blow. Yeah, take that. Finally, that guy was the mask. It's getting away. Well, he might have put it out this far, but that mask is sure to keep making trouble for us. I always thought Bentley's eyebrows are like hair or something. I can't tell if it's part of the glasses or if it's actually his eyebrows. I don't know, it looks weird. They're connected onto his glasses, but at the same time, I don't think... I don't remember the last time we, uh, seen him without his glasses. Guess I'll do this one, because it's a little bit tougher than usual. Do a barrel roll. Ah, uh, we don't have Dimitri's color commentary. Oh, I need to get used to these controls again. What did you think of the playing gameplay in Slide 3? Mm. I thought it was good. Mm. It's fun enough, I guess. But it's the same problem that Slide 3 always has. It's just one of those other gameplay types that you barely uh, get to, you know, get familiar with. You finish the episode and that's it. You, know, you don't yeah. see it again until the end. 
It's actually weird that they brought it back at the end. Because you would think that the final episode would be of everything that you've learned so far. All the major stuff anyway. Oh yeah, and you know how many how many different boats you ride in this game and how different they all are? There's the boats, you know, like uh, the Venice boats where you're in those t canals. Oh yeah, and then there's like the rowboat. Yeah, you got the rowboat, and then you got the... You got the other boat in the pirate chapter, the, the two boats. You got the pirate ship and you got the other ship boat. Oh, the one with the old cannon? Yeah, what? they're all played differently. Don't you find that weird? They're all different. Yeah, know? I guess so. And they're all boats. And yet they never brought back that. He also didn't bring back the, you know, the naval combat with the ship. Considering how, you know, much you had to do in the last chapter, I'm surprised they didn't make you do that again. But yeah, can you imagine if you had, if they brought back all the gimmicks for the final Gosh. level? <laughs> Just at one point, you have to use all the different type of boats. All of them. And they had to bring back her, and they just had to make up dumb reasons why you have to do it. Sly, Murray has the rowboat ready for you. You're gonna row out, and you're gonna... Yeah, do something. And then when you're done with that, you gotta get out the jolly boat, and you gotta blast them with the cannon. Uh, Bentley, why aren't they all in one boat? Don't ask. Also, I took out one of the plates, apparently, by them crashing on me. And then I suddenly die by something. Okay, where are you? There you are. How convenient. I playing the shaman escape. No, we already did that. It's just these two. You want to do this? Okay. And after that, we can do a quick round of Sly and Carmelina. And we're finally done with this demo disc. Oh, except for that video of the sky, too. Oh, yeah, you remember the guru's voice? Yeah. Ah, that soft spoken, weird language. That's not his voice. That's Thank actually his beta voice. But tell me, how do you plan to escape? I wonder if that's actually a for way he's actually saying his actual words in a different language. And that they weren't just making him mumble. <laughs> Too true. Wait, here comes a guard. Time for the experience how dumb the guards are in this game. I love it when you do that. Hold L1 to the spear. Where did he go? Master, you're the greatest. That Somebody forgot to put the radio filter on Murray. I like how it sounds like he's right next to you. Show these miners who's boss. Head for the drill. I guess Bentley's found a weak spot. Don't forget you can do that to all the other guards, and it makes traveling much quicker. Just don't crash into anything. If you want to stop, just press the square button and they'll shoot and they'll stop them for a bit. Or you can do that and kill them. You're on the wrong way. 
Oh, actually, no, there's a platform there, but, eh. I like how that monster, that big truck is still there in this demo without context. not where your goal is. It's right wow. there. Do not engage the locals just to get to your waypoint. Your talents are impressive, Guru. Oh, they gave me Oh, they gave me it. Uh-huh, yeah. 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 You pretend to understand me. <laughs> oh, that baby. Oh, that dungeon is gone. Oh, yeah, some things never change. Well, we gotta do the whole thing again, ram them into the drills. Only this time they don't, they're not crusher things. Come on, there's not even key cards this time. They're only ripping you off. Oh, doesn't this environment look like a good place to do baseball in? Uh, 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 I don't know. You don't remember? No. Remember that part? Remember how there's supposed to be those jobs where you're supposed to, where Sly, where Bentley shows up with his bombs and he tells Sly to bat? Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh. Oh, no, he doesn't bring his bombs. He brings, uh, no, he does bring the bomb one time, but, uh, no, you gotta bring the hooks. I like how the whip connected and it still killed him. There's never a good Garvey you need it. To the refinery. How to laugh if you hit the fan blades while trying to catch get onto this guard. Oh. Am I trying to get to? You'll see it. Hey, there's what's that intruder doing? Uh, I don't feel interested anymore. It's platforming with those guards. Provided you can jump a few guards over there and ram it. Oh. Oh, never mind. First victim. Let's get going. No, oh, that door is not important to another job. And even then, that job's to get another gimmick one. It's the claw one. Where you gotta pick up a claw and you gotta use it. Oh, Wrong know. way. No, the gunshots won't work on that generator. I tried. I look at your measly 13. You are the pos you are possibly the last victim. 
Chuckling to the last death. Last breath. That is not safe. Yeah, I drive completely. You saved the environment a bit. Now for the now for the 2P mode. Slide Carmen needs to stop slide all times. Okay, where's my where's my head? It's up. How do I strafe? Heat seeker. Okay. Wow, this is not good. I kind of strafe. Oh no. How did I miss? I can't make a jump. Fun fact, if you use the paraglider in this game, in this multiplayer mode, it instantly unlocks you the trophy for the HD version of Slide 3. That's how I was able to do it. Oh great. I knew you were no match for the clockwork guys. You're not getting with that loot. Heat seeker. Ah, oh, this skin. I don't want it. Smoke bomb. You better not use that on me. Hypnotize. Uh oh. Oh wow, it still got me. Mega jump. You're lucky I don't have the mega jump. Don't even try hiding in your safe house. There, I got all bases covered. You can't cut hide in here anymore. Rocket boost. I'm not gonna even have a chance to catch up before I can use this. Oh, that actually right. hit? Okay, can't find a spy icon. That hit me instead. Teleport. That was useless. No. Teleport. Okay, but well now we trade controllers. And create a bigger tangled mess of the controller cords here. Mm -hmm. oh, if only Hackathon was on this. Easy. What? Oh no, my thing's only pointing at you. Okay, I don't know how you did this. Skill. Just a lot of practice and skill. Goodbye. No, I don't want another one. Heat seeker.
Okay, I might have just went into charted territory and then probably went, uh oh. I can't hide under this. No, this is a bad area to be in. There's nothing here I can collect. Why do they even bother leaving this in if it's not gonna have anything in? Alright. I don't want the shield. Effective. Ah. Oh. Oh, you're dead. Heat seekers. Smoke bomb. Oh, where's the waypoint? Oh, I really need mega jump. Oh well, this is what I have to do. Oh, that was too close. Okay, just one more tri loot and I'm done. Where are you? You have a compass that points you straight at me. Oh well, I'm already there. I'm about to make it. Yeah, I win. Darn. Oh, and I guess that's it. Just Disgaea 2 trailer. That should be it for this demo disc. We officially conquered multiple demo discs. The majority of them. Disgaea 2. Okay, show us what you got. Okay, yeah, I don't need to play the deadliest game. So that was total damn zero. Total damn zero again. Again. How can I trust your fancy moves if they don't do any damage? Strategy RPG. Turn gamers into insomniacs. This one will surpass them all. To return his family to the original human forms, his young man struggles to live up to his promise to bravely oppose the evil overlord Zenon. As overlord Zenon's only daughter, she lived a pampered life and knows very little of the outside world. Came to Veldine with the single goal to defeat the legendary Overlord Zenon and steal the title of Greatest Overlord. Had no time to read anything else. Hold damage zero. Now, now it starts. Hold damage zero. of characters. All of them will turn you to insomniac. Uh oh. Good one.